The Pentagon has ordered a second carrier strike group to the eastern Mediterranean Sea and is sending Air Force fighter jets to the region as Israel prepares to expand its Middle East operations, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin said in a statement Saturday. The U.S. warships are not intended to join the fighting in Middle East or take part in Israel's operations, but the presence of two of the Navy's most powerful vessels is designed to send a message of deterrence to Iran and Iranian proxies in the region, such as Hezbollah in Lebanon. The movements are part of our effort to deter hostile actions against Israel or any efforts toward widening this war following Hamas's attack on Israel, Austin said in the statement. The USS Dwight D. Eisenhower strike group, which deployed from Norfolk, Virginia, is headed to the eastern Mediterranean. The aircraft carrier was initially set to sail for the waters of U.S. European Command. It is unclear how long the Ford will stay in the region once the Eisenhower carrier strike group arrives, one U.S. defense official told CNN. The Eisenhower, which is the flagship of the carrier strike group, will be joined by a guided missile cruiser and two guided missile destroyers, Austin's statement said. The Eisenhower can carry more than 60 aircraft, including F-A-18 fighter jets. The Ford can deploy more than 75 aircraft. 